The first question is about um, Ohm's law. And Ohm's law is basically um, I is equal to the voltage, or the current is equal to the voltage over the resistance. So if we have something like uh, 5 volts, okay, for the voltage, and our resistance is like 1529 uh, ohms, and ohms is written like so, we'll actually get a result that is, let me go here, let me close that over here and do this one, we'll end up with something that looks like 5 divided by 1529. So that's what, 0 0.00327 amps. So we can write that like this, 0 0.00327 amps. Or it can be written as milliamps. We won't worry about those milliamps right now. Now, just a quick demonstration of that. We could always go into this circuit, and we could pull up something that has 5 volts, bring our ground here, and then we can drop ourselves a resistor in here and double tap on that resistor and make sure that this resistor is 1529, so the calculation can actually be done here as well. Then we can just go ahead and wire this up real quick. All right, so now if I select, it says, what is, if the voltage um, is 5 volts, then, you know, what will the current be? So you can see that the current is given right here. So the current is actually um, 3.27 milliamps, okay? And so if I say 2.37 milliamps, uh, that's the same thing as our calculation right here. 3.27 milliamps. The reason why it's not showing up as uh, 3.27 milliamps here is because you just have to understand that a mil is going to be a thousandth. And so this thing is going to be, it's the same thing as 3.27 amps over a thousand. So that's what we mean when we say a milliamp. That's pretty much it for question number one.